Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to learn how to use the image picker controller or in other words, to change the, uh, to use the camera or the photo library to change an image of a product. Okay, so let's say I want to click onto that iPhone and Apple just released a newer version of iPhone. Of course, at this time, it, it doesn't, but let's say it does. Then I want to click on that one and goes to something to pick a new image or take a new picture even, okay? And that's actually a very powerful feature and it uses everywhere, okay? So, but first, I want to um, mention about two things. The first thing is this one. We don't have a title for that, right? And the second one is we can click on that cell. That's good. But on this cell, we can also click on that. Well, why is it? Well, because it's simply, it, it's a, a static cell, a static UI table view cell. Meaning, it means that we can click on that, but I don't want to click on that. I just want the user to click on the field and that um, text field, text view, right? So let's do that first, and then we can fix the label, uh, the title. Okay, so let's open up Xcode. Let's actually, um, change the title really quick because we can do it very easily in here the in view did load we can change the title to be let's say edit okay because we are editing so let's run there you go we see that or we can like edit product because title is a property of the view controller okay I will click on that one and edit product okay or you can go wide with like edit iPhone or even just the name of the product okay so let's have these these like um, not be able to select a cell okay so I would do mark table view interaction okay so I will implement this method table view the will select view will select um, row at index path okay it's the very last one so I will select that one and here I will check if because I want to I want to select the first one okay I don't want to select the other so this method just pass just return the index path I want to be able to select okay if I don't want to select one then just pass nil because this is in NS index path optional. So let's do that. If index path dot row, I'm sorry, dot section equals equals zero, meaning that the first section in index path dot row equals equals zero, meaning that the first row in the first section, it is that image, okay, that image. And then I will return index path which is this one okay and if it is the otherwise I will return nil meaning that don't re select that so let's run okay so there you go okay very cool I can select that one but not this one not this one also so that makes a very uh, concise user experience okay so how about the I will tap on that one and tap on this image and then I can change the image how cool is that so let's do that okay so I will have mark um, let's say image picker controller okay because that is what I will we will need to do okay so to do that we will need to check if we check on this one we can click on that one then we will present the ui image picker controller okay so let's implement that it is the method of new table view and that method is did select row at index index path did select row at index path okay and here we actually don't have to check this again because we already um don't like we already prevent it from here okay but let's just to make sure that this 
is the case that the first row right then we will we will present the image picker controller let's do that let image or let's picker equals UI image picker controller okay and then we will need to uh, specify the source type of this picker controller picker dot source type equals UI image picker controller source type dot well I can choose photo library because I am running on a on a simulator but you can actually choose camera so that if you are running on an iPhone or even an iPad then you can represent a camera and you can take a picture of a new device how cool is that okay but this is actually a very um, sim simplified version of this because in the real world there are devices i devices like the ipod touch ipod touch doesn't have um yeah some of those have uh the camera okay but maybe my just maybe some devices doesn't have a camera so you have to check on that okay but for the sh uh, sake of the tutorial let's just choose the photo library okay and i want to the image that allows editing to be false okay but yeah talking about this i am reminded that now today most of the devices having a camera like even the ipod touch its camera is wonderful right so we will picker dot delegate okay i have to specify the delegate to be self because i want to present the ui image picker controller on this stuff and then i will present view controller present view controller well you we will have to call this method so that we can present this view controller modally okay because it doesn't work on other things like push or something okay we will have to modally present it and this one is picker animated true and we don't care about completion okay well this yelled at me because i haven't specified or i haven't uh, let the edit table view controller or this self to conform to UI image picker controller delegates. So let's do that here. Scroll to the top and UI image picker controller delegate. Okay, and I also need to UI navigation controller delegate, but it requires me to conform to those two okay so what else well what if uh, after I pick the image right I pick the image then I successfully pick one so I will need to implement this method also image picker controller that finish picking media with info okay there are actually another method that I have to do like the error method then if there's something error with the picker picking process okay so, but for this one let's just do this one so i will have let image equals info sub ui image picker controller and i will use the original image okay and i have to cast it as ui image because this one returns an any object and i will just assign back to products dot image equals image and i will use product image view dot image equals image and what else well we don't need to use the um, we don't need to use the image picker controller anymore so let's dismiss it dismiss view controller animated true and we don't care about we don't care about completion so let's pass nil all right that's basically it we just need to check this one in, uh, instantiate a new instance of the UI image picker controller specify the source type you can choose photo library or dot camera you need to do allows editing phones or true okay we need to uh, delegate this picker controller to the self and present it okay when the finish this that finish picking media with info we will get the image I use the original image Cast it as UI image and then change it for the product and this view image view 
and then I would dismiss the view controller. Okay, so let's run this. Let's make sure I hide that. All right, so I would select um, maybe this iOS. Okay, and then I will select this one. Right, for the first time, it may be all right. So it asked me the permission to use photo library. Okay, this is the security uh, feature in iOS because what if uh, what if the user doesn't allow you to use that, right? So if if one user accidentally press don't allow, then maybe we'll have to check that. Okay, but let's say okay, okay, and then I will select moment. Okay, so this one, how do I got this one? Okay, so it's very easy, but be, uh, for now maybe you don't have that. So let's let me show you how to do that because I have a new image right here. Let's say I want to change that. So let's I will go back by pressing Command Shift H. Okay, so I go back to home, or I can go to hardware and home like that. Okay, and then I will go to Safari. Safari is really great because it uh, it allow us to drag just one image from that to it, and then it will save it to the photo album. How cool is that, right? So I will go back to my pretty apple and I have a new image here. Let's cancel. Click onto that again. I have the image. All right, you see that. So let's say this is iOS 8, iOS 8, okay, and this one is wonderful, wonderful, all right, <laughs> typing on this is not very fun, okay, so come back, all right, where is it, here you go, look at this beautiful image, okay. So our app is finally complete. Congratulations, we have learned a lot in this series.